When it comes to working with your realtor, if something doesn't feel right, you need to speak up for yourself and research. I'm working with a set of sellers who are relocating out of state. And when they came to me to get their house on the market, they already had an agent they were working with to represent them in the purchase of the property in the state they're relocating to. As we've been working together, getting their home ready for market, we've been talking multiple times a day. And they asked me if they could ask some questions about some things their realtor in the other state were doing that was making them feel a little bit uncomfortable they wanted to see if it was normal. These are repeat clients of mine. I sold them the house I'm about to sell, so I'm very protective of my people, and of course, I love giving advice about real estate. They proceeded to tell me that the realtor they're working with in the other state is advising them that she will not be submitting any offers on replacement properties until they are only a week away from closing escrow on the home that they're selling. Additionally, she's telling them that in this state, it's very normal for the buyer to waive the full inspection contingency. When I heard this, both those things were major red flags to me, but I'm not one to throw a realtor under the bus. So I told them, let me do some research. Let me call my person in that state and ask if that's how it's done. So I called my realtor friend who's in that state that they're relocating to and I ran this by her and she was mortified and told me they need another agent ASAP, which is what I suspected. Now I will say this other agent is right in one front. It is easier to get your offer accepted when you are only a week away from closing escrow on the home that you're selling, but she's clearly not putting any thought into what that does to you as a buyer in a new state. Relocating anywhere, but especially out of state, is extremely expensive and extremely stressful. So let me get this straight. Her advice to you is to basically pay for a hotel room or an Airbnb for almost a month while you wait to close escrow because she wouldn't submit an offer for you until you were only a week away from closing on the home that you're selling. And advising you to waive your inspection contingency, that is putting you at major risk. This story ends with a happy ending. I was able to do the research for my clients, come to them, let them know my major concerns, and introduce them to the realtor I know in that same state they're relocating to. They're now actively working with that agent, making offers, and we just entered escrow on the home that they're selling here in California. The moral of this story is if something doesn't feel right, you really need to do research for yourself and see if your realtor is being honest with you or if they're being lazy. Moving is stressful enough. Your realtor should be your ally in the process, not a stress factor. If you're looking for an agent in the Sacramento region, I would love the chance to work with you. I'm Megan LaHerrera and I've been selling homes for close to two decades and I know I can help you reach your real estate goals. And even if you're moving out of the area that I service, reach out to me. I know fantastic agents all across the nation and I don't send referrals unless I know their work ethic and know that they will do a good job for you.